Welcome back to our Your Rentals tutorials for importation of listings. This is step number three you have to take after we have imported all your listings. And this is about calendar importation, exportation. And this will set up the booking dates and will synchronize uh, with any other calendars that you might have where you have been taking your bookings. So, um, the first thing we need to do, guys, is we need to go to calendars page. And this is a blank property, the one that we have loaded before on the on the step number one and two. And we have fulfilled all the information and now it's time to for us to check the availability of the property. So from the calendar page, we need to configure the importation of other calendars. Let's call it like central reservation calendar. So for that, we need to click on calendar sync. And in this case, import a calendar. I will take my calendar from Google where I used to have my bookings and I will name it Google Calendar and input that. So you see that it has been imported and we can see that in January I have some bookings. I'm checking March. I have as well a booking for two nights and this is how it will be showing on our calendar. Okay. You can also use the iCal export to ensure your central reservation calendar and any other calendars you use are updated about your rentals bookings and your rentals requests. That will be as well showing on those. You can also have uh, more articles about uh, calendar importation and exportation and instruction uh, to import other popular calendars right here on our help center. It's very simple. See you next video and please be sure to check it out. We will be talking about the channel manager where you set your channels for your properties.